Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're doing a little swimsuit haul. It's not a haul as such, it's more like uh, my swimsuit collection. Let's call it that instead, because some of them are quite old and some of them are quite like newer purchases. Some of them won't be available, but some of them will. So I will link obviously all of them below. Before we get started, don't even come at me for my hands, okay? It's another fake tanning issue, all right? You guys are used to this by now, all right? Just breeze past it, all right? <laughs> And let's get straight into the sick bikinis that I have for you guys. Well, it's not for you, they're for my body, but I get so excited by bikinis. I have found the perfect bikinis for me. I absolutely love a high-waisted brief. I used to, I don't know what I did before a high-waisted brief. I always thought that high-waisted briefs were kind of like, I don't know, I never thought they were that flattering on me. Um, I've never tried one before. I just saw them on other people and I was like, mm. I'd sawn like though, sawn? I'd sawn. I'd seen those sort of like, um, not bikinis and they're not swimsuits. They're sort of like longer versions of a top and like normal pants. Do you know what they're called? I don't know what they're called because they were they were two pieces, but they looked like a swimsuit. It was really weird, but I was like, mm, don't like those. And so I think that's why I was like, oh, high-waisted, don't know. Last year or the year before, I tried some and it was a game changer for me. And now it's all I will wear. If you guys have a similar sort of like shape to me, I think you definitely need to try a high-waisted brief because they will change your life, seriously. They will change your life. Um, and I've just realized how orange my hands are to my face. And now I'm very embarrassed. <laughs> one or two um, swimsuits, but I can only see one. So I think it's just one. And the rest are gonna be bikinis and they're going to be high-waisted, okay? Because that is what I enjoy in a, a bikini bottom. Um, so that's what I'm going to be showing you guys. So let's get straight into it. And we're gonna go like brand by brand. So who should we start with first? I think we should start with Monkey because they are, you know I absolutely love monkey and surprise surprise that doesn't stop at their bikinis so let's start with their bikinis this is the drawer of goodies just for you uh no again for me uh so first of all we will start off with probably my favorite bikini now i recently got this pink gingham bikini from monkey they kindly sent it to me as part of like their swimwear campaign so uh, yes they sent me this one and the yellow one that's coming up also soon um i absolutely love them again high-waisted brief we love to bloody see it and it's so so flattering on me i bloody love them i think if you've got bigger boobs so i'm a I don't know whether this is too much for, for a YouTube video, but I'm a 32 double D and they, they fit quite nicely in this. I think if you're bigger, they could be a little bit of an issue to get into and like stay in. Cause when I'm like laying about and like you know, moving, they do kind of center, but I got them both in a medium. Yeah, and they fit me perfectly, like a glove, glorious. And that's how I like them. I like them to be quite like fitted. I don't like a loose bikini brief. You giving me loose bikini briefs, get out get out i like to be in and also with tops obviously like you want to be the comfiest as you can possibly be but obviously some of these tops are a little bit um i'll pop the prices obviously and the sizes anyway up on the screen for you like i always do along with like the images on the um website so you can see what it looks like on that person as well as on me because we like a little bit of representation over here that's what we enjoy so then the next one is this lovely yellow i've got a bit of a thing for yellow i don't know if you could tell i've got a bit of a thing for yellow at the moment i bloody love it i think it looks so so gorgeous i'd used to go against yellow purely because i used to think i'm pale it's not gonna look good but now i've got a little bit of a tan a fake tan um i do quite enjoy it and even without it as well i just think yellow is just a lovely color why did i go against it i don't know it's absolutely gorgeous again i've got these in a medium um i haven't worn them yet so they've still got like the plastic and the tags in fits like a glove we love to see it it's a medium again um and then i also got this more of a more of a bra -y sort of thing like a brawler i really enjoy this again i've still got the tags on most of these because where have i been because we've been locked down the past year so i haven't been anywhere hot in the uk as well as only just come out of a heat wave so i haven't had the chance to wear them all right so get off my back all right if you're trying to judge me with my tags in my bloody bikinis get off my back <laughs> we've got this lovely yellow one this one is a little bit see-through it depends how you feel about see-through bikini tops but they, they fit my boobs in nicely again double d's so and i'm fine with them i think if you're a bigger cup they might be a bit of a struggle to keep in but i think they've got like different styles 
in their top halves as well as the bottoms i think they've got like different um variations and different styles in the colors so you'll have to have a look online um and then the last two from monkey okay this one i got via asos i don't know if they'll have it on their website but it's this so so stunning um a little stripey multicolored um bikini top these actually come off as well so you can have it as just a normal little bandeau sort of thing really lovely again i got it in a medium and i just love their colors don't they remind you of like a um like a beach hut or something it gives me beach hut vibes i won't lie and then again high-waisted briefs we love them again in a medium and yeah what can i say what more can i say monkey i love your bikinis all right i'm living for them and then so last year i got this top half from monkey i don't know if they'll have the proper other brief but i got this one it's another one of those similar to the oh i've got something in my eye it's similar to the yellow one in that like the style sort of thing like a bigger bust then potentially this isn't the one for you but see what other ones they have available it's got one of those um these backs which i quite enjoy i think they're okay they're not too bad and then this year i thought i found the matching bottoms but i think they've come out of a different style of the daisy sort of s and um, bikini bottom because then i got these ones they look the same from afar but when you go up close they've got like bits of yellow like in the daisy so put a little bit more a bit more um thingy into the design um and i love them but they're a medium again but they're just slightly off but I don't know about you guys, but I tend to like mix and match my, I've got something in my heart. I like to like mix and match some of mine. So if you just have like a white bikini top or even a yellow one, if you've got yellow on here, have yellow or even a black one or a sage one. I think it's quite nice to sort of like mix and match, you know, from about the place. Um, so that is it for Monkey. Then we will pop across to New Look really quick. This one, you guys were a bit mad for when I posted my bikini try on reel. Um, I actually bought it last year. It's last year's new look bikinis. I absolutely loved them. Look at this blue. It's like a corally sort of blue, is it? I'm not sure. If you're a double D plus, I don't think this is going to be for you. If you've got quite big bazungas, I don't think this is going to be the one for you. I think they might have other styles again, but I i don't want to say buy it and then you're like abby i can't fit my tits in that i understand they are in the sale though um they are online there's a couple online but i think it might be a best idea if you went into new look and had a look because i saw on the sale rack that they are on there um this is like three quid now before it was like 20 pounds then i've got the bottoms obviously guess what they are they're high-waisted yet again got them in a 12 yeah a 12 and yeah again just look at that just look at that color phenomenal gorgeous i have got pictures of them like last year so i'll pop them up on the screen for you i used to put on a very heavy filter this time last year it was like a very pinky toned filter um but i'll pack it up on there anyway oh and also the top is a size 12 for me as well and i think it fits perfectly i think she fits she fits the gals in there quite nice um and then we will nip across to curvy kate i haven't really featured curvy kate on here very much but they are a very close friend of mine in my head i think they love me as well but um i love them very very much their bras are phenomenal and that doesn't stop at their bikinis their bikinis are elite they are bloody good bra brand so obviously their bikinis are going to be very very lovely and secure also so the first one i've got is this one these got these ones were very kindly sent to me as well last year i did like a takeover on curvy kate and i was dancing around in these like little bikinis it was quite fun i think they've got it on their highlights on their instagram if you want to go and see it it was like a year ago i've got this lovely little like floral get up i love as well the fact it's got like a little white seam here and here i do think that's quite nice and then when you've got a tan as well i mean look at my orange tan with that again i think i've got these in a 12 yeah these are a 12 and then the top half is more like a bra again they're removable straps and then they've got those um again you've got the white outline which i think is really really flattering and really lovely like when you've got a tan it's gonna look phenomenal it's basically like a bra like it's gonna be really nice and supportive so i've got a 32 double d in this and they fit gloriously again removable straps so you don't have you can take it off get rid of your strap marks there's nowhere to be seen and then another one we've got is this little pink one again i've got photos in these but um they were very heavily filtered last year so i will whack 
but I'll try and remove the filter and get you like a more realistic one. <laughs> this one, I absolutely love it. I love the two shaded bra bit. I think it looks really, really flattering. When you see the picture of me wearing it, shoes, it looks amazing phenomenal and then i've also got again high-waisted brief they're all high-waisted briefs this is just a high-waisted brief haul i've got this again two-toned bikini brief they look so so flattering and if i do say so myself my ass looks very nice in these i will say so myself i'll link all of these obviously down below for you because curvy k are my so i think this book they've got refer a friend on there as well so you can get credit maybe i'm not sure how it works but yeah i got the trousers in a 12 the trousers the bottoms in a 12 curvy k bikinis i really really rate because you know what do you want in a bikini brief you want to be secure you don't want the girls going anywhere and um, trust me they don't go anywhere the last one that i've got for you here is little mono one see we have got black and white we just don't have black or white we've got black and white yeah i really really love this this is i don't know how to explain it like a zoomed in will probably help black outline on the top really really flattering it sounds like cinches you in a bit it makes you look very saucy i won't lie to you i think this one's one of my favorite bikinis I've, i think i've probably said that for most of them i love the pink gingham one the um, blue new look one this one i think they're quite nice sort of like staples you have staples in a bikini wardrobe i don't know for the top half again she's got thingy thingy straps so again you can take the straps off if you want to get rid of that strap line i love the fact with all of curvy kate's bikinis you can remove them so they're removable so you're still going to be really really fastened in there again girls ain't going nowhere even if you remove these because sometimes when you put the straps on they kind of like and then they've gone they've gone off your chest they're not on your chest anymore they're on your belly you know they've disappeared but the support is still there with the curvy kate ones they've got like there's a bit of underwiring there anyway can you just piss off piss off i got it in a size 32g again which is my normal bra size and i absolutely love them i think they're so so nice on to the last one which is asos so asos have got some pretty banging bikinis i won't lie to you they have got some bangers and this one went a bit viral um maybe a year or two ago like everybody it was doing the rounds on Instagram maybe a year or two ago. I don't know which way around it is. They're quite a they're quite a um, bummy sort of one. So my mum, it's quite funny. I wore this with my mum. I think we were over on a beach maybe or maybe it was a, oh Hendu. It was Hendu. We went on a spa day and I wore this and my mum was like, I do bummy bikinis and you can see like your whole bum. And I was like, mum, that's a you issue. I enjoy this bikini very much and you're not going to not see me in it just because you don't like my bum, just don't look. Um, um, it's not like she didn't like my bum she just doesn't like bums on display and i was like i see you wishy <laughs> but if you are after something that kind of like hides your bum a bit more i think the curly cake one the monkey ones as well kind of hide your bum a bit more so it's not too like wedgy you know um and the new look one as well that's not very like wedgy whereas this one this is the top as well it's just a little bandeau so again if you want a low supported bra not isn't it, it's not even a bra a bandeau if you want if you need low support very nice but if you want a more high supportive bikini then this ain't your gal yeah all obviously links are down below and again what size do i get that in i think i got it in 12 yeah uk 12 for the top and a a uk 12 for the bottoms also um and then last but not least we have a swimsuit this is the only swimsuit i think i own but i really really liked the colors and i just think it looks so so sick look look at this look at those colors a little scoop back very nice and i just think the colors look so so sick so if i'm gonna go swimming at least you, you're not gonna lose me you can't you physically can't lose me i just realized in the bikini haul i forgot to mention this one from hollister these are the tops very sexy i got them both in a large because i'm a large on hollister so this is the top as well little 360 view for you your little saucy old things yes look Rah, rah. and that is all of them that's all of the bikinis that that is all of the bikinis that i have for you um i hope you enjoyed if you did smash a like and subscribe um if there's anything else you'd like to see from me swimwear wise please do let me know and i can definitely try and arrange that for you obviously 
do I need to have a little moment with you and say, get get a grip? Do I need to tell you that? Because I don't think you need telling to get a grip. I think you've already got a grip. I think it's one of the, it's a weird thing because I, I was self-conscious to wear bikinis like a good couple of years ago. I was a bit like, mm, not sure. But I just feel like, you know what, life is too bloody, I know it, that is the worst thing you could say. Life is too bloody short, okay? Last year proved that. No one gives a toss what you're wearing on the beach. You do, because you're thinking people are judging you, but they're not. They don't give a rat's ass. They couldn't give less of a shit about what you're wearing, alright? Whack it on and have a good time. That is all I have for you okay we have got a summer this year all right we've got a summer don't go fucking it up because you're too insecure about what other people are thinking of you all right no one gives a shit whack it on and have a marvelous time you're probably gonna look so fucking sexy that everyone's gonna be looking at you because you look so fucking sexy all right that's the that's the mindset okay whack it on look in the mirror you look like a fucking snack that is all you need. That's all you need. You need your friends and your family. Gas you up. Yes, you look sexy. Yeah, you know you look sexy. Now get out there and have a bloody good summer. All right? That's it. That's the TED Talk. Now get out there and have a good summer, okay? Have a good summer. And that is all from me. All right? Hot girl summer. We're having one, all right? I don't care what size you are. No one cares what size you are, all right? We've just had a year of shit, all right? We don't care what size you are. You're having a hot girl summer. We're getting out there. All right, you're hot, that's it, period. You're done, all right? Bikini body, got it already, done. You've got a body, lovely, got it, lovely. Go, go, go and buy a bikini and go and look fucking sexy in it. Okay, love you, bye. I'm sorry, I went off the handle a bit there. <laughs>